opposite end of the pitch. Gary Rogers at 39. Oodles and oodles of experience, not to mention medals. Now Dundalk could be in here. Opportunity for Duffy! Makes no mistake. They go route one. And they profit with an early breakthrough. Dundalk in front inside three minutes. And it's a quality finish at Longtown Nils on Dock 1. Again, look, it's a great ball over McElhenney. He sees, he sees it on a Duffy. Great first take, cool finish. And that's just the difference in class. I mean, the, the Athlone defender just switched off for two or three minutes. Midfielders didn't Theory. track. And again, a great ball for Duffy. And it's gone in despite the best efforts of the goalkeeper. Patrick McElhenney picking out Duffy. And the keeper is beaten. He was just off his line and stranded. And Dundalk have nabbed a second. It's just a brilliant run by Duffy. I mean, hasn't been picked up. Hasn't been picked up for ball, but what a ball. Great little finish, little dink. No, the keeper's off his line. Just caught 2-0. And again, it's just totally switching off. I mean, you just can't do that with a good guy's like the quality of Duffy. But you can't give McElhenney that time on the ball to pick the Prevent the club from being relegated. Well, they have a lot of plans here at Lontan as that corner is swung in and there's a free header and it's into the back of the net and Dundalk have got themselves a third. Andy Boyle up from the back for that set piece. Not picked up and it's 3-0. Again, it's just, it's, it's just poor defending. I mean, look, he's not being picked up. You can see it there. No man marking. So is it zonal marking the doom? Free header, back post. That's good. Gets the return pass, Patrick McElhenney. Mountney unmarked at the back post, and he heads it in. How easy was that? Goal number four for Tadok. McElhenney again, I mean, three assists, and every one of them is quality ball, but it's just people switching off. I mean, again, it's the back post, that's two in the back post. The run hasn't been picked up, Mountney's gone in, headed back across goal. It's 4 0. Easy. I mean, that's. Simple stuff, you know, you've got to take your own and to get oh, the ball back. Shields has won it back and Athlone could be in big trouble here. McElhenney! Well, they gave it away so, so cheaply, Athlone, and they were made pay the price. Again, they're trying to do the right thing, play it out from the back. There, cop, there you go, there's Chris Shields at his best, putting it to McElhenney. He's just been outstanding tonight. Shields made the goal, McElhenney finished the goal, and it was just everything about what they've been tonight and that's in a nutshell there and it's five and it could be anything Duffy now Patrick McElhenney Shields getting involved as well Manning trying to uh, get goal side McElhenney slips it over the top looking for Duffy and Duffy into the area and the ball runs loose and it's uh, knocked into the back of the net by David McMillan well, it's turning into an absolute rout, no doubt about it. And Dundalk, well, they get their sixth goal of the evening. Well, it's going to be a long, long evening for Athlone Town. Again, you just have to admire it too, though. I mean, it, it is very hard for Athlone, and you know, unfortunately, the keeper just spilled one there, and he's unlucky. But again, you can see, Mac, uh, like, a McElhenney's knocked it into Duffy. I mean, it's, it's, it's the same, it's the show, the McElhenney-Duffy show. to his right. Shields winds up. Shields! Oh! What a goal! Chris Shields. Well, he doesn't score too many, but that's just so, so special. Really is. What about this from Chris Shields? You don't have to score many when you score them like that. As we say, that's different class. I mean, you look, he's taken and he picked up the pass. Acres of space. He's teed it up. And if you put a top bin in there, it's right in the middle of it. Brilliant, brilliant strike, and you know we're just talking about this, the un the unknown stuff he does, yeah. and he goes in and puts a worldie. But yeah, there you go, great, rootless, absolute hunger from Dundalk. Well, they've got this corner kick. Mount need to take. Gartland being picked up at the moment by Grogan, who hits the deck. Corner comes in, and it's a free header, and it's lashed into the back of the net. And the goal is given. Nathan Adua pouncing at close range. And it's another simple, simple finish. Yeah, but again, look, they've both muscled, free header. Unfortunately, the poor goalkeeper's just spilled it again, unfortunately for him. You know, it's just one of those nights. It just hasn't gone right for him. And every mistake that poor young fella's made, 
He's been pulled by McAlenny for a Dua, trying to tee it up, and it's slammed into the back of the net, and the Duck have scored yet again. And McMillan celebrates. Well, it's uh, definitely record time as Dundalk close in on what would be a momentous achievement. But they're racking up the goals, big style here, Pat. Yeah, but again, it's McElhenney. I mean, he's, he's, he's drifting definitely into all the space. the ball in the second half since his arrival at half time. Adua trying to get it away from Delaney. Still Adua inside the area. And across the six yard box, it'll break here for McElhenney. Patrick McElhenney forced away from goal. Teeing it up with a hit from Flores! And there it is. Another spectacular Dundalk goal. And it is 10. 10 up for Dundalk. Nonchalant. Brilliant finish. I mean, again, look, Adu has done wonderful. He's knocked the ball. Defender caught. He's knocked it back. Keeper's just panned the back goal. Flores, you know, it's just a beautiful strike. I mean, McElhenney's brought it inside. Plays a square. Flores, one touch. Or two more to be honest which in the next six or seven minutes because they're you know I think at loan are out in their legs as well Adua and now McElhaney inside the area jinking this way and that it runs loose opportunity for Murray Murray with a shot Murray with the goal Dundalk record breakers and in some style yeah, a great strike again from outside the box you know not, no, not, you can, not, can't get there not closing down but it's clinical, you know, all, all the strikes outside the box are either top bins or bottom right-hand corner, left-hand corner, you know, it's, you know, the shooting practice has been brilliant tonight as well, and the creation again, Odua, and they've been knocking around the Macmillan again three or four times.